hi everyone welcome to another video so today's recipe is some um, curry turbid fish so this is a turbid fish i have it right here uh we the fisherman actually separated the skin from the turbid fish so we have the, the flesh right there at the skin right here so the turbid skin is very thick it's tough to be kind of say tough so they take it off just like that so if you hear someone saying that you're tough turbid that's what they're talking about this is what so just ensure that you clean it up inside out clean everything as much as you can look at his teeth <laughs> oh my god yes so that is it so i went ahead and i cut off the tail because i'm not going to eat that we're not going to eat that so we don't need it so this is i'm sorting it ensuring that it is well salt because the turkey fish is full of flesh it is very fleshy like really fleshy look at that all that meat it's one of the ex most expensive fish in jamaica can you believe that this fish costs thousand dollars thousand dollars for this one fish yeah thousand dollars so this is it i'm just using some black pepper and I'm rubbing inside and on the both sides some maggi all purpose. You see me use some salt before. So I'm just ensuring that you get enough seasoning. This is some maggi fish seasoning that I'm using now. Just ensuring that everything get coated nice because you don't want the fish to taste a bit raw when you're eating it, right? So I'm cutting up some onion, some skeleton thyme, pepper, Irish, and carrots, my usual, for doing, you know, any curry food. Adding the curry to it, allow it to burn a bit in the oil, as well as some paprika and some garlic powder after this, yeah. I'm just allowing it to cook down a bit and saute in the oil and then I go ahead and I add some water two cups of water by the way and I allow that to cook down and then I add some maggi all purpose some maggi fish seasoning and some salt and also half teaspoon of butter and then I allow it to cook down a bit and I add the fish this is it mm -hmm. Just ensure that you coat it well and then eventually turn it over on the other side mm. look at that bubbling y'all <laughs> and this is it guys this is how it was when it was finished you can eat this with some mashed potatoes or with some dumpling and irish and yam and banana this is some healthy food y'all thanks for watching see you in the next video